Hey, what's good YouTube Nate, Mass Collector, back with another video. Uh, this is a mail, mail week video. Getting kind of behind on these, I gotta edit a couple of them yet. But um, today is April 30th, and this is what I got in the last week. So, I've really been hitting these uh, Bowman's Best Honor Roll 1996 sets up. So this is a Kevin Garnett's um, and Jerry Stackhouse Atomic Refractor. It's a, Near Mint 8 PSA. And actually, after seeing some of these atomic refractors and just the regular refractors, um, I'm more of a fan of the regular refractors just because um, there's a lot more pop to it. So here's one that I just got too. So this is the the regular and this is the atomic. So Look at the jersey, how much better that looks on this version than, than this one does. It's just like the atomic is the only part that, that really shines. It's not, nothing on his jersey does at all or his body. So I like these a lot better. So I'm gonna start staying away from the atomics unless they're really super cheap and graded. So, but I had to get this one just cause it was a Garnett. It was a super cheap, you know, this is a second year card. Um, super low population on this stuff. Hard to get high grades, but so since we're kind of on that kick here, so I got this one as well with uh, Jerry Stackhouse. Um, I'm trying to, if it's cheap, I'm going to go after it, but I also look to make sure these things are centered well. This one isn't so good on the Stackhouse side, but on the Garnett side, it looks pretty good. It's a pretty clean card too. But again, Garnett's second year. Uh, here's another side-by-side -side comparison. I just got these in. Um, so Scotty Pippen and, well, Scotty Pippen and um, Dave Robinson's on the back. But if you want to look at the side-by-side -side of the refractor versus, versus the uh, atomic, again, I, I do like the, the regular version better because when you look at these atomics the jersey just doesn't shine at all it's just the uh the border mainly and a little bit in the background but you put this bad boy up here and the whole thing just shines i think it just looks a lot better so i think it's harder to get these in higher grades too than the atomics those two um i did get a couple grant hill with juan howards those two and then i got an ewing with carmelone oops and then i have Rennie hardaways and chris weather on the back so i mean you know, you're looking at two Hall of Fame famers on here. Pretty much all these players are or will be at some point. Um, here's another, just a stack of some randomness. I got some of these I actually bought. Some are just kind of thrown in as freebies, which these top three were. So um, Larry Johnson rookie card I got from some dude as a free one. Uh, Steph Curry and Dermon Green. Revolution. This is base cards. I'm sorry, not Steph Curry. Andrew Wiggins. I don't think you'd be getting Steph Curry away. How's that make you feel, Jermon? Um, I got a LeBron, NBA City, NBA Hoops Premium Stock, 2019. Super cool looking card. Um, I bought a couple of Colin Sexton. So I found this listing that had a bunch of the new fast break prism stuff listed for five bucks a card and um this colin sexton was one so just a regular prism um he also had this ruby wave so i got this for five bucks not it's not numbered um i got this dinwiddie pink fast break which is numbered out of 50. i got this for five bucks and i mean it's not like he's a super all-star but man Pretty good player. Uh, Rudy Gobert, purple out of 75, $5. Dirk Nowinski's 
out of 75 for five bucks. And then I got the shack, it's just a regular knot. And then the guy threw this one in for nothing. So the, the laser shack from NBA Hoops Premium. Um, I picked up a couple Kevin Porter Juniors. Um, I've been PCing him a little bit and kind of just investing in a lot of his uh, his rookie and second year cards, mainly his second year cards now because um, they're a lot cheaper. Plus you can get parallels for a pretty damn good price. Um, this one here is out of 125 and this one here is out of 99. I could probably double my money if I sold these right now because he just dropped 50 points on the Bucks last night. Him and my next guy, Christian Wood, he had 31 and 10 rebounds last night, I think. Giannis didn't play, he got hurt right away. Um, this one's about a 199, this is the Press Proof Donruss. Um, here is a purple, it's on 99. I think I got like four or five of these now. Uh, this one here is out of 49. This is the blue. And I just, this, I dig this card. It's so cool. Uh, here's some more just prism. So orange cracked ice. I got a couple greens um, of his. And I've just been trying to get, if it's super cheap, a dollar or two, I'll buy it. But it's got to be centered now. Uh, these two hypers I got from buying into a break. So I bought Christian Wood um, for like a case and uh, two hypers out of it. They're not centered very well. So, And then these all I bought individually, which all look really good. So purple cracked ice. Um, I got this is out of 175 and I have three of them. They're all really, really nice condition. Now this one here I got for five bucks from that same listing. This is the red uh, fast break out of 125. It's cool. Uh, orange waves out of 60. Uh, just the orange. Again, I'm just trying to get centered cards um, out of 49. And then I got a blue shimmer, another one. I think this is my third one. Um, and this one is out of 35. And I bought a big one the other day. I bought a gold out of 10, number one out of 10 the other night. I haven't got it yet though. But And then let's bust through these Dennis Rodmans I got. So I bought seven... Um, of these super cheap and those and they came with this card here so um, prism 2013 green it's not numbered but it's really good condition um, this one I got for three like two bucks it's really nice last year's prism silver uh, got a purple wave really nice centered not numbered I got a red out of 299. A little bit off center, but not too bad. Uh, I got a couple purples. Cracked ice, which are out of 175s. And you guys know Robin's in my PC. Uh, orange out of 49. And then I also picked up this. Uh, the last card here is the uh, Hot Numbers. Um, flare 95 96 um the faces on these are always perfect because there's no ink on the face of it it's a a sticker that's on the back of this thing like you remember those rulers that we had when we were in grade school um <clears throat> i still got a star wars one somewhere but the uh a lot of wear around the edges but you know this one will be like uh, stay in the PC type of thing if it gets a lower grade. That, that, I'm not really concerned about that. I just love this card. And I got this one here, which is, I just kind of stumbled upon this on eBay. I wasn't searching to know it or anything. Um, the reason why I bought it is because this is the very first Jordan poster picture that I ever had when I was a kid. 
So that's why I bought this one. It just like, boom, hit me in the face. Like, holy shit, man, I had that thing hanging in my bedroom wall for, you know, a decade, it seemed like. But yeah, it was cool. I mean, the dude's got hair. It's a second year, you know, second year playing because he's got his uh, Jordan Air Jordan 2s on. Super cool. In the back. So this thing came out in 1994. It came out in 1994. Yeah, super cool. I know it's only a seven, but it's not about that. It's just about uh, buying, the, buying the card, not just buying the, the grade, so. All right, cool. So um, guys, really appreciate you guys checking out another video of mine. Uh, again, please subscribe if you haven't yet and you're enjoying the content. Like that video, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment or two, and also hit that bell for notifications when I drop new videos, and we'll see you in the next one. All right, guys. Later.